Alright, hi, this is Mark Shepard and uh, I'm, I'm here today uh, in my garden and uh, I have just a, a thought about stopping anxiety in some ways is really a lot like seeing your mind as a garden. And I have a new garden here that I've just made and um, it's, a, it's a raised bed. And what's happening is we just made this the other day and the soil is is just kind of exposed. We haven't mulched it. We haven't planted anything yet. And what's happening is um, maple seeds. Let's see if you can see this. That's a maple seed. Um, maple seeds are falling in to the the raised bed, as as are some other seeds. And essentially, <laughs> those represent the thoughts in your mind that you don't necessarily choose to have there. You know what I mean? So. Part of managing your mind is to see yourself as a gardener and to to kind of the thoughts that you don't want to be in your mind you can not not in a mean way but you can gently pull them out you can weed your mind and you can plant in your in your mind's garden only those things you want so uh, I just thought that was a you know an interesting thought now sometimes stuff grows in the garden <laughs> that is a volunteer and is good stuff. Sometimes your, your intuition, I apologize for the wind and, and I don't even know if this video is going to be usable, but um, in this garden we have some, some things that we've just planted and in order for these to be healthy we're, we're going to have to continue to, to nourish them and, and weed them and, and to take care of them, you know, so I think, I think that's the thought for today is that your mind is like a garden and you're the gardener. You have control of what comes into your mind. You have control of what you allow to stay in your mind. All right, so happy gardening. Mark Shepard, stop anxiety. It, it really, you don't have to have it. You can stop it. Crushanxiety.com. Thanks so much for watching. Bye now.